Question 9. The diagram shows a prism. Work out the volume of the prism. Now remember, a prism is a shape, a 3D shape, that has the same cross section all the way through it. The cross section is that this L shape. That L shape goes all the way through it. For example, a Toblerone box has a triangle going all the way through it. So the cross section of a Toblerone box is a triangle. The cross section of a Pringles box would be a circle. Now, if you can't remember how to find the volume of a prism, it tells you right there. Volume of prism is equal to area of cross section times by length. There's the cross section times by length, so they're even telling you how to do it at the front. So, we need to find the area of this L shape. Uh, what we're going to do to do that is we're going to split it into two rectangles. It doesn't matter which way you go, I'm going to go down. So the top rectangle is 4 times 7. 28 centimetres squared. This rectangle is 2 and not 9 because all of that's 9. That bit's 4, so take away 4, that means that's 5. 2 times 5, which is 10 centimetres squared. So, cross section is equal to 28 plus 10, 38 centimetres squared. So, volume of prism is equal to the 38, because that's our cross section, times by 10, 38 times 10, which is 380 centimetres cubed. Because that's the volume, it's already given, so we don't have to worry about that.